friends. Getting follow botted on Twitch is one of the worst things that can happen to you as a streamer, or at least it feels like it. Um, it's a moment of panic. You're not really sure what you can do about it. And you just feel kind of lost. Fortunately, there is a tool that exists thanks to Commander Root that will remove those followers exactly in that window from your channel. You can block them so that they can never follow again. You can just remove them in case you're risking removing other followers as well. Um, and it is amazing and it helps streamers so much. So today when I got follow botted, fortunately I knew about this tool and I was able to remove a couple batches of them live while I was on stream in under 30 seconds and it was wonderful. But what I realized when I started talking about it in chat and then posted about it on Twitter was that a lot of people don't know how to use this tool, where to find it. They're scared they're gonna remove all their followers. So what I wanna do today is help you. I wanna help you. I wanted to show you very quickly how to use this tool um, and hopefully this can remove some fake followers for some streamers out there who might be panicking about it so before we dive in if you want to support the channel you can hit that subscribe button or you can hit that follow button on twitch where i stream live every day but outside of that let's dive right in on how to remove those pesky follow bots what you're gonna do here is you're gonna go to google and you're gonna google commander root follow remover it is commander root you can google how to spell commander um, make sure that it is the commander root follower removal. It will be the first thing you see at the very top of your screen. Again, thank you commander root for what you do for the community. You are incredible. You're just going to click follower remover. When you get here, when you get here, it's really, really simple. You're going to log in via Twitch. It's going to make you uh, sync with your Twitch the very first time. I fortunately already done this today. I've already done this today. So um, it's going to log me in right away but you're going to hit login via twitch it is trustworthy it is safe it's going to take a minute while it loads up all the followers um and while we sit here again guys um for those of you who think you're helping streamers for those of you who think you are helping streamers um and aren't doing this maliciously and just want to help your favorite streamer hit a follower goal or a milestone and you want to hit them with fake followers don't it, it, this this is not helpful. You are not helping them. I had so many people in chat today be like, what's the problem with fake followers? They're not real. They're literally fake. It's in the name. The followers are not good for engagements. They are not good for anything. And they actually look bad when it comes to Twitch. So that's what's so amazing about a tool being able to remove something that can be bad for your engagement, bad for your image, bad for your reputation. Um, another quick thing, if you have, before we dive into this, if you have been follow botted, if you have been follow botted by anyone and you want to remove these also send a ticket or an email to twitch support and let them know that you were follow botted if you know the person who follow botted you include their name in it make sure that you let them know that this is happening so that they can maybe make initiatives along the way that can help prevent these things from happening and make you look a little bit better and so that they don't think that this is something that you're doing to your own channel okay we're going to full screen here and make this bigger. I'm going to disappear for a little bit and I'm going to show you guys exactly how to fix this. So what you're going to do now is you are going to find the exact time that these followed accounts hit. So for me today, this was at 111 my time. So followed up between April 1st and right now it's 149. So we're just going to go 111. We're gonna hit that zero zero on there and they come in waves and I like giving it a little safe window to make sure that um, I'm getting all of them, the ones that might have trickled over afterwards. And you're going to go to, you know, 112, I'll go to 1250. I'll give it a minute and 50 seconds that those rolled in. You make sure this is one way. There are other ways to find accounts created between here. I don't wanna risk those. I don't know when people created their accounts. Um, there are ways that you can do it with minutes between account creations and follows, um, which is another way to read out maybe the ones you've gotten over time that you're not aware. You can specifically look for usernames um, that might include a word in them. And you can explicitly look for people who are already banned for chat to just filter them. So now that I have the exact time that this happened, I'm going to hit apply filters. Boom. Filtered follows 138. So you see all of these names here and you could specifically go through and remove follow and block, just remove the follow, exclude them from removal. If you happen to see, oh my God, this person's real and they were typing in my chat and I don't want to remove them you can rem unremove them. Unfortunately, all of these are fake follows. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to remove them and block them from refollowing so that I do not have to deal with this ever again, at least from these accounts. 
So you, then you hit remove followers and block them from refollowing. You're going to get a confirmation. You're going to get a confirmation message up top that says this will remove all of these listed followers. Are you sure you want to do that? And you're going to hit OK. And then look how fast she goes. 100 left, 90 left, 80 left, 70 left, 60 left, 50 left. And there you go. They're removed. Um, and it's as simple as that. It really is as simple as that. Removing all the followers done. If you hit apply filters again to make sure that none are left, you say filtered followers. There are zero. No followers found using this filter. Um, I actually got hit twice today um, post um, removing the other one. So we're actually just to double down. We're going to show you guys one more time. I also got hit at 126. So we're going to go and we're going to type in 26. We're going to go to 2750. We're going to apply filters. Oh, maybe I was wrong. Or maybe he removed those already. There it is. It was 125. We're going to back up a little bit. We're going to back up a little bit, actually. Um, and do 124 just in clay case. And we're going to hit apply those filters. So here's that thing I was telling you guys about through here do you see this person this person is not a follow bot i remember them specifically from coming into my chat so i'm going to say exclude user from removal also these ones down here i know that they weren't follow bots either they were talking to me in my chat so i'm going to click it and i'm going to exclude from removal i'm going to go exclude user from removal all the rest through here happen to be either twitch workshop or the workshop elite um and we're going to hit remove all followers remove them and block them from refollowing again that is 135. This will remove all listed followers. Are you sure you want to do that? Okay, done. And that's what we're doing. Um, and now it's doing them. Zero, they're all gone. For some reason, it did not remove this one. But hey, it showed, nope, they're gone. I lied. They're all gone. Filtered followers, 138. Um, guys, a big thing, a big thing here, as we switch back over. A big thing to know here as we switch back over, if you accidentally, if you accidentally remove somebody um, or you know that you got somebody blocked that wasn't meant to be blocked, you can unblock somebody manually in your chat, you know, forward slash unban or anything. There are also um, most of the time, if you got a real person, um, they're going to submit an unban request. They're going to go, hey, um, I don't know why I was banned. You can probably explain that, hey, you got banned during this tool. Um, if it's a legitimate person, they'll probably submit that or they'll reach out to you somewhere and let you know. Um, this was a very short very condensed video but i hope that it could help somebody this is one of the most frustrating things for me and before commander root came around and gave us a tool that we could fix this with um this was just a nightmare this was a nightmare that we had to sit and we had to email uh twitch support and hope that over time they would remove them themselves and sometimes it took up to six months um, and that could give your numbers feelings of inflation and then six months later you see yourself decrease in numbers and you wonder why it happened um, but fortunately we have a tool. I'm going to drop the link below. If you don't want to Google it, if you don't want to do all of that, I'm going to drop the link below the video in the YouTube description. Um, and I just, guys, this was it. Um, I'm not really going to push for anything else here. I just really hope this video can be helpful to somebody. I know how much of a nightmare this is, and I hope this explained it easy enough that anyone can use it. Thank you guys for watching. Hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed the content.